Hi, this is Richard Price from Digital360. Um, I'm a Zoho Alliance partner in New Zealand. Um, I thought I'd just do a, a quick video um, to show those users of Zoho Mail how to simply take a screenshot on your Windows computer and then insert it into a Zoho Mail email. So I go into a Zoho Mail and I go Compose. Now say I just want to take a screenshot of my screen as it is um, sitting here. I can just hold down the Windows key on your keyboard. It's usually down in the bottom left hand corner and then press print screen. It's usually P-R-T-S-C and that's usually towards the upper right corner of your keyboard. So you um, hold down the Windows key and press print screen email. and then let go and that will automatically save that screenshot into your pictures folder on your Windows machine. Now this works as far as I understand on Windows 7 and 8. Um, I have not tested it on Windows 10 or XP and below. So then you go into your email, you put your cursor in there, you click on this little icon next to the smiley face which is insert an image. You go choose file and you go to your pictures folder and there it is there so I just select it I wait for it to download and go insert and that inserts it into the email if you simply do a print screen without holding down the Windows key that'll only save it to your clipboard and when you go and you paste into here it may show up in here but when you email it to the recipient the recipient won't be able to see that image they'll see a broken image so this way is just a shortcut way so you simply um, whatever you, this, you've got on your screen that you want to to capture you go hold down the windows key and then print screen and then go into a blank email or uh, the email that you want to insert it in you click onto here go choose file double click on the um, uh, picture that you want just wait a couple of seconds for it to upload and then go insert and there you go. You can also click on it and you can um, then resize it. So you can click on it and then click on that insert button and you can resize it. So let's say we only wanted a thousand then you can see it's shrunk it down. So you click, insert, and then you can redo that. So I hope that um, helps. Uh, if you've got any questions, uh, just uh, drop us an email, richard at digital360.co.nz. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.